A few hours after the accident, colleagues of Sergeant Rosenthal addressed the media, visibly shaken by the news that greeted him this morning. They were quick to make sure everyone knew the kind of person and the kind of officer Adam Rosenthal was and all he gave to his community. News Channel 5's Marcy Gonzalez joins us live from Delray Beach with the story of some of the people whose lives he touched. Marcy? Kelly, the grief is certainly rippling through this community and this department tonight. You can see the black and purple memorial bunting hanging over the station tonight. The place Sergeant Rosenthal worked for 16 years, serving as a road patrol supervisor. He was on the SWAT team and served in a number of other positions. He was commended nearly 90 times for his service here. And for that and for so many reasons, he's being remembered as an amazing man. The phrase, the good die young, um, is, is true this morning. The sting of that truth still raw. Adam also leaves behind a heartbroken family here at the Delray Beach Police Department. That heartbreak at the department Sergeant Adam Rosenthal served with for 16 years, magnified for his family at home, where he leaves behind a wife and four children, and echoed here. <laughs> Rosenthal spent almost every night here at XF Martial Arts, running a program he founded called the Delray Judo Club, where he taught underprivileged children and turned their lives around. And these kids really, really looked up to him. He was absolutely amazing. Took kids off the streets, kids that were in gangs, turned their lives around completely. I'm um, going to college now, a lot of the kids. Sergeant Rosenthal was a role model to them as well as his two sons and two daughters. The type of father that everybody would wish for. And he was the type of friend anyone would wish for. Adam was larger than life. Um, there was nothing he wouldn't do, um, go out of his way to help somebody. And we're going to miss him a lot. A lot. Thank you. And there will be a fundraiser for his family on Friday from 7 until 9 here in front of the police station. If you can't make it and you would like to make a donation, we have all of the information in the Scene on 5 section of WPTV.com. Live in Delray Beach, Marcy Gonzalez, WPTV News Channel 5. Stay with News Channel 5 for continuing coverage of this tragic loss and how it's being felt across the community. We will bring you the latest on the accident investigation and any funeral arrangements for the fallen officer. That's